The following voice tape contains full frontal nudity, graphic violence, and sleazy innuendos. Man, I can't wait to hear it. Hello, this is Gregory Peck, and all the voices on this tape, including this one, are being done by voice actor Tex Brashear. This is Ricardo Montalban. Welcome to Texas Fantasy Demo Tape. Hi, this is Elroy Judson, and the reason I like Tex Brashear is because... I'm all spaced out anyway. <laughs> this is Lawn Green. You really should listen to Texas voices. They're a real bonanza. Howdy, this is Rex Allen Sr. asking, would you buy a horse from this man? Hey, baby, this is Wolf Bad Jack, and you're listening to Tex Brashear. But why? This is Howard Gosell, and Tex Brashear's self-aggrandizement is Miss Quasi Hensible. Hi, this is Huckleberry Hound, the little blue dog. I love Tex almost as much as my darling Clementine. Hi, this is Arnold, and if you don't love Tex Brashear as much as I do, I will crush your stinking skull. This is Detective Colombo, and why anyone would listen to Tex's demo tape is a real mystery to me. Oh. Archie, I wish you wouldn't call Tex a meathead. This is James Earl Jones, and you're listening to Tex Brashear on CNN. Yo, this is Sylvester Stallone, and the only thing more dangerous than my right hook is Tex Brashear's breath. Hello, this is Alec Guinness, and Tex Brashear is almost as enigmatic as Obi-Wan Kenobi. Well, hello there, this is Bing Crosby, and the only thing I like more than singing is... Hearing Tex Brashear shoot his mouth off. Hello, this is Charlton Heston. Holy Moses, Tex is good. Hi, this is Larry King. And later in this demo, we'll be speaking to funny man Leslie Nielsen. Hello, this is Leslie Nielsen, and I'd be impressed with Tex's demo if it only had some burping or farting sounds in it. <coughs> Ah, uh, much better. This is Inspector Luger. That Barney Miller doesn't have anything that Tex Brashear doesn't have. This is Garfield. Just think, I could be taking a nap right now. Hello, this is William Conrad. I played Cannon on television. But if I had a Cannon right now, I'd blow Texas tape to bits. This is Red Skelton. Thank you, thank you, and may God bless. Yo, this is Alf. I wouldn't even be here except Tex promised me 10,000 big ones. I didn't know he meant pesos. Tony the Tiger for Tex Brashear. He's not good. He's good. Hi, this is Jonathan Winters, and I'm going to do my impression of Tex Brashear. No, 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 it's too hard. Here's my impression of Elvis. And you see... Elvis is dead, you get it? Ah, uh, this is Yogi Bear, and I like Tex almost as much as a picnic basket. How about you, boo-boo? Gosh, Yogi, you never let me get anywhere near a picnic basket. Ah, uh, shut up, you little smartass. Boy, I have heard, I say I have heard some silly things in my life, but this here takes the cake. Hello, this is Sir Cedric Hardwick, and in spite of my British haughtiness, I still rather enjoy Tex Brashear. This is Lawrence Welk, and if it weren't for Tex Brashear, polka music would be dead today. This is Dr. Claw. I love all that is evil and rotten. That's why I love Tex Brashear. This is Morris the Cat, and I'd rather be anywhere else. Meow. Hi, this is H. Ross Perot. Want to know why I love Tex Brashear? Because we Texans stick together, goddammit. Hello, America. This is Casey Kasem. Stay tuned as we count down the top ten reasons why Tex Brashear should be banned from this country. Hi, this is Red Fox. And if you're not using Tex Brashear for your talent, then you're a big fool, sucker. Hi, this is Mickey Mouse, and that Tex Brashear really thinks he's the big cheese. <laughs> hmm. Hey, Papa, I take that. Wow, that Pluto is as mean as Tex. Ah, <laughs> uh, this is ex-president Bill Clinton. Hey, Tex, did you think of these things on the sperm of the moment? This is Latka. I believe Tex should get in a taxi and go very, very far away. What do you think, Alex? I don't know, Latka. I don't think a decent taxi would pick Tex up. What do you think, Jim? I don't know, Alex. 
All this talk about taxes giving me a headache. Hey, Sheriff, do your duty and warn everybody about this Tex Brashear. Hi, this is Andy Griffith. And Tex Brashear, he's good. Hi, it's me, Ernest T. Bass. I love Tex Brashear almost as much as my beloved Romina. This is Maxwell Smart. Would you believe I've had just about enough? Hi, this is Charlie the Tuna with Starkist. I got good taste. But I like Tex Brashear anyway. Hello, this is Mr. Haney. And if this here corn keeps popping up, I might as well go back to Hooterville. Hello, this is Droopy Dog. I thought I was a sad case, but after listening to Tex's tape, sheesh. Hi, this is Sunny, and I'm cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs, and I'm cuckoo for Tex Brashear. <laughs> hey, sweetheart, if you ask me, Tex Brashear is nuttier than a hill of beans. Hi. This is Richard Simmons. Okay, ladies, let's make those butts sweat. Ah, sweaty butts. Hi, this is Joe Pesci. Now Texas tape is starting to get interesting. Hi, this is Liberace, and I just adore Tex. But then again, I love all men. Hi, Garrison Keeler here, and truth be known, I named my fictional Lake Wobegon... After Tex Brashear's face. And this is Grandpa Amos. And that god darn Tex Brashear is a real McCoy. Hello, this is the late Orson Welles. And if Tex keeps this nonsense up, I may have to drink my wine before it's time. Hello, angels. This is Charlie. Your assignment is to find this Tex Brashear and kill him. This is the Crypt Keeper. Hello, boys and good. Are you ready to be scared to death? Then keep listening to Texas voice demo. <laughs> Hello, this is Vincent Price, and that man scares me almost as badly as Tex. This is Peter Lorre. Talk about scary. I've seen Texas face first thing in the morning. <laughs> this is John Kerradine. I have been tortured many times, but compared to this. Twas nothing before. Hello, this is Sean Connery. I'd rather be getting killed as 007 instead of listening to Texas demo tape. Well, hello. This is former President Ronald Reagan for Tex Brashear. And, um, um, oh, hell, what was I going to say? Yana, Donna, Donna, hey, John. Yeah, what is it, Cheech? Like, how come you like Tex Brashear so much, man? I don't know, man. It must be the drugs. This is Gary Owens reminding you that Tex Brashear does not condone the use of drugs. Bullwinkle J. Moose here. The reason I like Tex Brashear is because, unlike my friend Rocky, the flying squirrel, he doesn't stand around playing with his nuts all day. This is Jack Nicholson. Tex Brashear is as good as it gets, man. Oh, oh this is Elmo Fudd, and Tex Brashear is sillier than that crazy rabbit. <laughs> eh, what a dope. Uh, does Tex Brashear do any foreign accent, or does he just sound like uh, us regular guys? Oh, the answer should be blatantly obvious, you bloody twit. Ah, the truth be told now, my personal belief, is that Tex Brashear be more Irish than a leprechaun? Da, ah, comrade. Tex Brashear may not be Russian, but he can drink as much vodka as I can any day. The people of Pakistan will be bored because the Taliban will not allow our girls to go to school. Eh, hey, my lad, haven't you learned your Scottish geography? The Firth of Forth is not something to drink. It's a place. Well, I'd much rather it be something to drink. My name is Speedy Gonzalez, and I am the fastest mouse in all of Mexico. But Tex Brashear's tongue is even quicker than I am. Arriba! Bonsoir, this is Maury Chevalier. And although I am dead, I am still very French. Hello, this is Dr. Ruth Westheimer, and on today's show, we learn how to enjoy sex, even with our own husbands. How are your law, Shad? This is Justin Wilson, and that damn Tex Brashear's phonier than an alley gator floating belly up in the bayou. I guarantee. Also, Confucius say, marrying someone for their looks is like buying a house for its coat of paint. <laughs> this is Robin Leach, and you're listening to Lifestyles of the Big and Famous. Hello, this is Julia Child, and if Tex Brashear were a cake, he would have flopped a long time ago. Uh, this is Jimmy Stewart, and, and if you ask me, 
that Texper share is just, just dripping with talent. If you feel like you've been injured while listening to this voice tape, please call the offices of Burnham, Cheatham, and Scroom. Hi, this is Rick Dees reminding you that Tex Brashear should be considered armed and extremely dangerous. If you see him or know his whereabouts, please contact Robert Stack. This is Robert Stack reminding you that Tex Brashear is one of America's most wanted. Should you know his whereabouts, please contact the local authorities. I am one of the local authorities, and no children, animals, or trees were injured during the making of this voice tape. Copyright 2012, Tex Brashear. Good night, Gracie.